since we're here at Parents and Family Weekend, uh, I'm going to ask you a quick question. Does anybody know, or do you happen to know, when we rehearse? At night. We rehearse at 7.30. We get out at 9.30 most nights, twice a week. I wanted to point that out because 7.30 in the evening is not the beginning of the day for these students. Indeed, some people have classes that start as early as 8 o'clock, and they come to rehearsal after they've had a full day of everything else, and then at the end of the day, they get to come and play music. Now, for many people who have spent a whole day from 8 to 5 or whatever it is, might say, I, I need my evenings. But these students say, I need my music. And it's, I wanted to point that out particularly because it's, it's a mark of real dedication and real commitment to the music that these students sit before you and are playing the way they do. Are they playing all right? I'll give them a pretty, pretty good, because you know, I gotta maintain my, so I'll give them a pretty good. But I say that because this week uh, was a challenging week. Uh, one thing I'm very proud of here at Duke is that we bring in a bunch of guest artists and they spend several days at a time. So that's what, you know how UPS says, what can Brown do for you? I was mad that they took that because I used to say that. But I didn't get to the trademark office in time, so I can't say it. But I can say that's what Duke does for you. We bring in guest artists and give our students experience of actually spending time with some of the biggest names in the world of jazz. And uh, certainly tonight's guest is no exception. And our students, while they still face the challenges of the day with their various labs and exams and whatever else they had, they came to rehearsal on time, ready to go, attentive, and ready to receive what the master musician had for them. Uh, if you find a person who is anyone notable in the jazz community who said they don't know Sly Hampton, you can remove the notable part because he has played with everybody, knows everybody, and everybody knows him. You didn't come to hear me, you came to hear our students and the great Sly Hampton. Freddie wrote this composition that we're going to play for you in honor of Booker. 